Hello people, welcome back to the fun Indian guy channel. First of all, this video is going to be on vertical format, not on horizontal form. Crazy. Vertical format, not on the horizontal format because I've shot it in vertical format and I want to experiment how does it look or feel or how it is being taken by people. So if you're watching this video on your computer, on your iPad, I would request you to go back on YouTube of the fun Indian guy and watch it on your phone in vertical format because that will have a better impact because that's how the video is made. Anyway, the next thing I want to talk to you about is the video which you're gonna see is about Gothenburg which is in Sweden and that was my first time in Sweden actually I was there to visit my friend Shruti and some more friends which you will see in this video so let's enjoy Gothenburg from Sweden <laughs> So basically that's how we were going around the place and Shruti was showing us different different places inside Gothenburg because she's studying there and we had some more friends with us like Shweta, Niharika and Sushant and it was really amazing to see Gothenburg because it was first time in Sweden as I said before. After that we experienced Fika time. Fika is basically that time of the day usually around 4ish when you are at work you take a break and then you have a sweet and a coffee and usually sweets are cinnamon rolls or cinnamon buns and that's what we did we went for the traditional experience of fika we actually have something similar in italy as well called miranda but we went for fika so let's go and enjoy the delicious footage of fika <laughs> So after roaming around and having fika, we went on a hill to see a Mastuk church. This church was on top of the hill and you had really beautiful view of the harbour as well as the town or the city. It was a bit windy there but it was really good to just film some footage for the video on top of it and at the same time just have good times with my friend. <laughs> While having good time, I thought about entering this church. So me and my friend went there, we opened the door. Usually these churches are closed, but to our luck, the church was open. And the best part about it, like we entered the church and there was a concert, like an orchestra concert was happening inside. And the amazing part about the churches is like, churches are well designed acoustically inside because there are church organs, which should be audible at every corner and in every space or every place of the church. But when you have the whole orchestra in front of you in that same acoustic environment, it's just beautiful. It was peaceful, beautiful. It was soothing. So I sat down and started filming this orchestra, which you are able to see right now. It was just mesmerizing. <laughs> So basically I went to Gothenburg to meet Shruti because Shruti is my friend from engineering times when I used to study in Mumbai. And there was also Shweta who is Shruti's twin sister and Niharika who is also a friend of them. All three of them speak Marathi which is the same language which I speak. All four of us are from the same region of India and also have been brought up in similar culture. So we kind of had a similar way of thinking and it was easier for us to connect. So basically in these three days or two and a half days, we cracked so many jokes as we had similar references. It was just pure fun time. And I had it after a long time. I was really happy to be there and just talk random stuff and just crack up on anything and just laugh all the time. It was really amazing. And what happened afterwards is like when I came back to Berlin on Sunday night and Monday, I went to work and I, I was just super quiet. Like I was really really quiet which is very unusual so one of my colleague came to me and asked me like suyog what happened 
why aren't you talking anything because as you must have guessed it right i'm used to talking a lot i'm used to discussing things and i love it it's it's fun and i hope also people like it but anyway i have fun that's more important but my colleague asked me that why am i not talking or why i'm not the way usually i am so i told him that basically i have lost my humor like i've exhausted my humor and i need a couple of days to get back to it because i felt empty after spending really amazing time in gothenburg i'm no regrets it was really fun super thankful thank you shruti shweta niharika and also sushant it was really fun we also played some music and all so basically it was really good time and that's why i really wanted to make this video to give out this message like it's more the people than the places like you should travel and see new places and get different perspective but always about the people people you know people you don't know all the conversations and the discussions you have and interactions you have with people make the places memorable or make the give the places meanings and it's pure awesomeness i don't i don't have words it's just fun that's all from this video should have been my next sentence but as i was in the new city of course i went on hunt to find a really nice cafe and i found one it also served a specialty coffee and i had v60 filter coffee which you will see now v60 is basically this cone where they drip water from the top and there is a coffee like grounds here and then you will see it in the video it was really amazing so we're going to see that and then we will say goodbye to each other let's go After that amazing time in Gothenburg that amazing coffee that amazing fika and the uh, Mastuk church time it's time to say goodbye to you guys in this video because this video is coming to an end first of all let me know how do you find the vertical format to be like uh, this is the first time so it's experiment basis apart from that thank you so much guys for 1000 subscribers on youtube i might to make one more dedicated video about that but till that time really thankful for that now we have more people still is exclusive 1000 people watching the content or watching the stuff i make thank you for your presence till the end means super a lot to me In the end don't forget to have fun because having fun is not an option it's a must so go out and have fun get out of your comfort zone and i need to do that it's been a long time i haven't vlogged because i'm getting bit comfortable with other things like podcast and just being inside the house and not taking efforts to go out and film and a lot of people have been asking me i should make vlogs i'm thinking about it it's not like i'm not i might as well make it i should stop talking anyway When you have all the footage and music it feels like super energetic and super pumped up but in in reality I'm sitting here alone there's just some birds chirping outside and it's not as fun as you see it on the screen but the feeling of making it the feeling of presenting it to you the feeling that at some point you will get to see this footage is beautiful in itself